Hi there, Mr. Lewis here. Um, I'm a teacher at Alexander McLeod and I started teaching here in 2010, but I also was a child at the school and I started my journey at Alexander McLeod in 1993 and I um, left as a child in the year 2000. It was very different there because then because there were a lot of um, teachers obviously are not here anymore um, teaching me and um, there were lots of, um, I suppose there were lots of differences in the way that different lessons were taught. They were taught in different ways. There were, uh, we have big TV screens now. If I turn here, we've got big TV screens in our, in our classrooms. But back then um, we had um, chalkboards or whiteboards. Um, and we also had some computers, but um, we didn't use computers a lot because there weren't that many. Whereas now there's a computer in every single room, lots of people um, can use them and lots of children can use them as well. There were lots of ways that the school was similar as well. For example, um, some teachers that taught me in the year, you know, towards the year 1999 and 2000, um, also taught me in 2000, also were teachers here in 2010, such as Miss Benjamin, um, a few other teachers as well who have since left. Uh, Mrs. Luckin um, it was, uh, was um, working in the school then as well. And um, Mrs. Hutchins, that's another person. So lots of people that have, have, have been, there, been here for when I was a child and as, a, as an adult now. Um, there were lots of differences in the playground. Um, the playground had um, a big football cage but now it's slightly smaller and it's covered in grass but before it was covered in concrete um, and we didn't have the reception play area um, we did have um, lots of benches in the middle of the playground um, but it was all covered in concrete as opposed to tarmac which we have now which is a bit softer if we were to fall over in the playground and we've got areas of grass as well now which is great yeah, we had lots of different we didn't have a big bus in the middle of the playground that's there now and a maple class the class is right by um the football cage that wasn't there that was just a big open space so it's a much bigger play area as well um, but obviously we've got lots of children, lots more children at the school now, um, which is something that's different, I suppose. And obviously this, I'm here on the top floor and this um, top floor was still here and this building as it was, was still this big when I was a child at, um, at school. Um, and another thing to tell you about what um, life was like back then was that we didn't have really much in the way of computers in the classroom. We had some computers, but not a lot. Like I said earlier, chalkboards and whiteboards, as opposed to the TV screen that you see here. Just as I was finishing at Alexander McLeod, we, our, our old school jumper used to be black. Um, but then at the end of my time as a child at Alice McLeod, it changed to blue, which is of course the color that you guys wear now. So yeah, that's just a little bit of information about me and my time at Alexander McLeod. Hope you guys enjoyed learning um, a bit about myself and my time at Alexander McLeod. And if you wanna find out some more and have some questions to ask me, please feel free to ask me on the playground or ask your adults and they can uh, forward your questions to me and I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks guys.